Hey everybody, so today I'm going to go after Christmas shopping and I'm going to hit up Hobby Lobby. I want to get some Christmas decorations for next year and I heard that today Hobby Lobby is supposed to have 80% off. So let's cross our fingers that we get our Hobby Lobby Christmas 80% off. First, I had to pick up my Starbucks because it's after Christmas and I got gift cards. Amanda gave me a gift card. Thank you very much, Amanda. Amanda does a lot of work on the website for me and she sent me a Starbucks gift card. So I'm enjoying my Starbucks right now. And the next place you're gonna see me is gonna be when I get to Hobby Lobby. So I'll see you guys there. I just found these decor lanterns and these are $39.99 but that makes them down to $13.60. This is like an everyday item so I'm actually going to just put those out all year long. But I'm going to grab one of these. They have a larger one but it's too big for what I need. I'm going to grab this one. They have these pears that are pretty cool and these are $29 so that makes them $10.20. They're Glass. There was one that was already broken, but I can't figure out like if a pear can go all year or if it's just fall or if it's just Christmas. So I'm probably gonna skip this one. But they have a really cool pear here for ten dollars. Oh, this is cool. One thing they have here is a lot of Dr. Seuss signs. Dr. Seuss is always cool, so I got getting this one because I think it's pretty cool and I will hang this up. And this one was 39 and now I believe it's 10 bucks. So let's see, 39.99, 13 So 66% off. I think this is a really cool sign, so I'm excited to have this one. I think I want this other sign too, though. This is a cool thing I just found. It's one of these letter boards. This is like felt where you put the letters in. And these were always really popular for like Instagrammers and stuff. This was 25, so now 8.50, so this is a really good deal. It is red, and a lot of times they're black, but it has Christmas colors, but you can use it year round. It looks good to me. I found these ornaments too. These are, um, red and white, which is kind of my three color, which is perfect, but they don't have a lot of these colors. These were $9.99, so they're gonna be about $3. Those are found clip-on birds. I love these things. So these ornaments, they kind of bounce around and you clip them on your tree. And these were $11.99, yeah, so yeah. they are gonna be down to $4.08. I'm excited to have some clip-on birds. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what I ended up with, and we're gonna go see how much it'll cost. So I ended up with these. I think these are super cool. They're shutterproof balls. I got three of these. These were regular. $10 each, so it'll be about $3.30. Got the Santa Claus, and he is on price, so we're gonna see what happens with him. Got this Santa, he's kind of a little guy, $4.99, so he's gonna be about, what is that, $1.60 maybe? This lantern that was $40, it's gonna be about $13, I believe. I think this is pretty cool, I'll put a candle in it. Clip-on birds, can't go wrong with clip-on birds. Eleven ninety-nine, so that's about four dollars and fifty cents. And then my Dr. Seuss picture. So we're gonna see what happens with all of these. And if you guys get to go out shopping, let me know what you get in the comments. I love hearing about what you guys get. So Hobby Lobby, a lot of stores are gonna be doing the clearance right now. And Hobby Lobby is the first one that I hit up. I was thinking it was gonna be higher percentage off than it was, but my stores are already getting cleared out at 66%. So basically with clearance, how it's gonna work is the higher the percentage off it is, the um, the less stuff there's gonna be. So you can start shopping now and you can kind of like figure out what they have a ton of that isn't selling and kind of wait that item out until it goes on a higher clearance. But let's go through the checkout line and see what So it looks like I spent $54.84, which would have been about $150, $200 worth of stuff. Um, still feel like I need to go buy some Christmas stuff. So I think we should go to Michael's because I think Michael's is going to have a higher percentage drop than Hobby Lobby is. So we're going to go to Michael's and we'll see what Michael's has and see what we can get there. And I will see you guys at Michael's. Okay, I have made it to, let me pull this out a little bit. I made it to Michael's where they are 70% off. I found this pretty cool thing right here. Check this out. 
This is a um, Santa plate and cookie. So it says cookie for Santa. There's a little jar. There's a little milk thing. Super cute. 30 bucks. 70% off. That makes it $9, which is pretty good. I found these too. These little lent letters to Santa mailboxes. This one's kind of um, messed up a little bit. A lot of stuff with clearance, you want to be careful when you are shopping for clearance because a lot of stuff has been sitting out and it isn't bought because it is imperfect. So make sure you're checking and make sure things aren't broken. Like if there's little, those little plastic things that kind of break easily or glass, just make sure all the pieces are together and there's not little bitty pieces um, taken off of it. Also check this out. They have all of their ornament sets right here behind me that are 70% off. These were like, this is 50 ornaments and it was $30 and now it is on sale for nine bucks. That's a pretty good deal for 50 ornaments, $9. And they have a whole selection of it right here that you can see. Also, what you want to look at is um, on clearance, they will have these Limax Christmas Villages. And the thing you want to think about with Michaels especially is their stuff will go to 80% off and then it will also go into those $4 grab bags if you watched a previous video that I did where I had the $4 grab bags. So you want to kind of like think in your head like what's going to go, and especially if you don't really want, need the item or you're not really that crazy about it. You want to think like what's going to be in those grab bags so we can go get those grab bags and get an even better deal. But, like the Christmas Village stuff is 70% off right now. That stuff's popular, it's gonna sell out. So if you want it, I would grab it at 70% off because every store I've been in is kind of already selling. I've been thinking about doing one and I think I'm probably going to because we have like a, this was $54 and this one is in, gonna end up being 16 bucks instead of 54 at 70% off. And there's just one left, people are already buying them. Here's another thing that I wanted. Like I really want these things, they're like these little red and white barns. But every store I've been in, they've had a lot of them, so it's not like a big deal. These are $30, that makes them $9, which I still think is a little high for these. So with so many of them, I'm gonna wait these out and I'm gonna cross my fingers and hope I can get them in those $4 grab bags when they go to $4, and I will feel much better about getting them at that price than the $9 price. So I'm gonna wait these out and we're just gonna cross our fingers we can get them when they do the grab bags. Search high and search low, you never know what you'll find. I found red wine ornaments right here. These are glass ornaments, which seem to be really hard to find nowadays. Um, these glass ornaments, they were 15 bucks. I'm gonna get them for $4.50. My tree's red and white, so this works out perfectly for me. There was just one of this color, so I'm gonna grab that one. My Christmas tree's kind of a mismatch anyway of all those colors, so this is gonna be perfect, and I'll be able to use these next year on the tree. One thing you'll see here, there is a ton of this garland. If you want this garland, there's a lot of it, and it's not really something I need. So this is something that I'm gonna guess will probably end up in those $4 grab bags, because there's just so much of it right here. So it's probably gonna be left over in those $4 grab bags. So we're gonna see when I get one of those, if I end up with some of this stuff, and we'll see if I'm right about what I'm predicting. But I wouldn't buy this at 70% off. I'm just gonna wait it out and hope I get it for four dollars a bag. We'll see what happens then. Those have pre lit garland at seventy percent off. They have quite a bit of it left. It's not really something I need, so I'm not gonna get it. But nine dollars versus thirty dollars is a pretty good deal. So if you're looking for garland, you might want to grab that. Another thing you want to check that I forgot to take a video inside of Michaels, but you'll want to check um, check on the Clarence candy too, because the candy that is like Christmas themed, which this really isn't even Christmas, is seventy percent off too. So I got some bean boozled. And I also got some um, Pez. These were 70% off as well. This is like Mickey and Minnie uh, Pez Dispensers 90 year anniversary set. Super cool, 70% off. So make sure you guys check the candy rack, it's also. And now I'm gonna head to Walmart. And poof, we're at Walmart. Walmart right now, I'm a blurry, I'm blurry, I'm blurry, I'm a blurry, I'm a blurry. Walmart has 50% um, off Christmas, so if you've been looking at Walmart stuff, the Walmart I'm in has a ton of stuff left. It's 50% off, so it'll go a little higher, um, but if you want the best selection, again, the best selection of stuff, head out while the clearance is early, and then kind of judge as you're going, like how many of each item they have, what do you want, what do you really want, and then keep checking back, and you can find it at a deeper discount. So don't buy everything at once. If something has like 20, 30, 40 of an item in your store, they're probably gonna have it as it clearances down further. So that'll help you to save money if you just buy what you really want first and then like, just kind of prioritize what you are gonna be shopping for. But there is a ton of stuff at Walmart. I'm gonna show you guys some of it real fast. Boom, off on the shelf. If you find out on a shelf at 50% off, these are probably gonna sell out, so I would grab them. This is what I'm, another thing I'm talking about. Like, there's two of them here, but look at this. See, this one's kind of damaged on it. 
So what happens is like people use them all year long and then people don't grab some of the last items because they're damaged like this. So this one I'm gonna skip, but this one is good. It's 50% off, these are usually 30 bucks, this is 15, so I'm gonna grab this one. Okay, another one thing. Another thing you will probably want to look at is the inflatables. Right now, the inflatables are half off. The Santa Claus are already running out where I am. Here's uh, this one right here. This was 15, so it'll be seven dollars fifty cents for a four foot Santa. And they also have, if you can see right here, a seven foot Santa that was thirty four, so it'll be seventeen dollars. Those are probably going to be gone before the clearance gets much lower. So that's an item you want to. There's some things here like the skunk. These might last a little bit longer. But basically, you want to like just prioritize what's going to sell out faster and then get those items and wait the rest out until they go on a higher clearance. Okay, so Walmart is done and I got one of those little toolkits and one elf on the shelf. And now I'm trying to figure out where else I'm going to go. And I think the next place I'm probably going to, I'm just going to hit every store. I think the next place I'm probably going to hit up and see what they got going on clearance is going to be Lowe's. So I'll see you guys over at the Lowe's. Okay, so Lowe's we ended up going to, but there wasn't a lot of, um, they didn't have a lot of product left, but it was 75% off, and that's probably why they didn't have a lot left. One of the things that you will probably want to look at for Christmas is when you're shopping is look for power cords, because power cords with Christmas packaging usually end up being the discount, and they're power cords. I mean, they're usually just in regular colors that you can use year-round, and you can get them a lot cheaper when you're buying them at holiday clearance, so make sure your guys are checking those. Low 75% off is really, really good. There was a couple of stores that I wanted to hit that I missed, uh, Target and Dollar General. I'll probably hit those when they go down to a lower clearance than the 50% off. But guys, just as I said during this video, what you'll wanna do is just um, pace yourself with when you're clearance shopping. Like if you really don't need something, wait on it to go on a lower clearance if there's a lot of it. So you can get better deals if you go multiple times. And what you guys can do to know what your stores are doing, because clearance, clearance can vary store to store, is call your local store in the morning and see what their clearance rate is. And then you can ask them, they'll tell you, and then you know if you, you want to make the trip or if you want to save the trip and wait for the clearance to go a little higher. All right, guys, that's what I have for you guys today. Sorry that I was MIA kind of during the holiday season. It gets really busy for me. I do a lot on Facebook with giveaways and stuff, so that's where I've been. But I'm back on YouTube. I'm sorry I've neglected you guys. I'll be back make, posting videos again regularly just like this. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, and please subscribe to my videos. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.